Hi, welcome to the Environmental Health Report. My name is uh, Carlo Diolem. In today's episode, we'll look at, at if uh, sargassum seaweed is uh, poisonous. Uh, we'll start looking at a few facts about uh, sargassum. Uh, then we'll look at if uh, sargassum seaweed is uh, poisonous. And then we'll end with my final thoughts about this topic. Uh, sargassum is a brown seaweed that uh, washes up on the beaches of the North Atlantic Ocean, uh, Caribbean Sea, and the Gulf of Mexico. The causes for uh, sargassum accumulations on beaches are purely speculative at this moment. The causes can be pollutant discharges, increase in ocean temperature, and hurricanes and storms. After 48 hours being stranded on a beach, as sargassum accumulations decomposes and release large quantities of gases such as ammonia and uh, hydrogen sulfide. And uh, when a sargassum decomposes, uh, beachgoers can notice a uh, rotten eggs odor. And uh, symptoms that are caused by uh, uh, Rotting sargassum uh, can be eye, ear, and nose and throat irritation, nausea, vomiting, headache, dizziness, breathing difficulties, memory loss, loss of balance, nausea, and tiredness. And uh, these symptoms uh, can be felt when people are not far from. Uh, Sargassum, rotting sargassum accumulations. Uh, to prevent uh, such symptoms, it is uh, good to avoid uh, lengthy close contact with uh, sargassum. And this is especially important for uh, people who have uh, respiratory disease, uh, such as uh, asthma, uh, because it can have a worsening of their symptoms and they can, or they can have uh, breathing problems. And uh, make sure your children don't eat sargassum. Or, uh, yeah, the, the rotting sargassum on, uh, on the beach. If you live uh, next to the beach, uh, close your windows and doors as soon as you, you, f you smell a rotting eggs odor. Uh, refrain from uh, touching sargassum and swimming next to it because the sargassum accumulation can contain uh, jellyfish larvae, which can um, cause a skin rash or, or blisters on your skin. If you're part of a uh, beach cleaning crew that will remove sargassum, uh, wear personal, personal protective equipment such as um, gloves, masks, and protective cl clothing. Also uh, wear a hydrogen sulfide detectors to uh, measure the um, hydrogen sulfide levels that you're breathing in. Uh, in closing, uh, check news or environmental health department uh, websites before going to the beach. If you experience any symptoms that were uh, listed on the previous slide, uh, contact uh, the Poison Control Center. Uh, the phone number is 1-800-222-1222 uh, or consult your health care provider. If you have any comments and suggestions, uh, you can write me at uh, ehreport411 at gmail.com. I hope you had a good understanding of uh, sargassum seaweed and if you enjoyed uh, this uh, short presentation uh, you can leave me uh, comments uh, below or uh, just press the like button button uh, thank you so much for uh, listening to this presentation i hope you have a great day